Now to an inspiring story of how a local woman transformed her life through simple movement. A cancer diagnosis could have sidelined Ann Arbor resident Teresa Myers, but instead it put her on a path to a special discovery. After successfully beating cancer, she found a fitness outlet unlike any other to help her continue her healing journey. Here now to tell us all about Nia is Teresa Myers, who is also now a black belt Nia practitioner. Teresa, thanks for being here with us. Thank you so much. I'm grateful to be here this morning. So first off, tell us all about how you found Nia. Was it during or after your recovery? It was after the recovery. I was left in a great deal of pain and limited movement, but my body kept saying, if you want to heal, if you want to feel better, you've got to move. So I went on a journey to find a movement that resonated with my body. So I checked out Nia for myself. I'm new to this and it, it looks really low impact. A lot of natural movements. It almost looks like people are just dancing. So for those not familiar with the practice, what's the experience like for first timers? Well, I love to say that it's low impact on the body. So you picked right up on that, but it's high impact on the emotions and spirit. What I love most about Nia is that Nia meets you where you are at in your movement journey. So you can take it in a softer, gentler range of motion, or you can take it all out into an athletic big range of motion. And walk us through, Teresa, how Nia can aid in people's healing journeys like it did for you. Well, I think the biggest aspect of Nia is that it's holistic and it taps into the physical, the mental, the emotion, and the spirit. And the one thing for me that I found through my cancer healing is that the doctors did a fantastic job healing me physically, but not necessarily a lot of support on the emotional, mental, and spirit. And Nia really helped me integrate myself back into who I am today. And that emotional and mental side, that is such a critical part of the healing process, as we all know. And you got into Nia, and now you're a licensed practitioner passing it on to other people. So why was it important for you to share this message and get other people on board to this practice? For the reason that you just said, for what it has done for me, I just felt that I had to share this with, with everybody else. It has been a life-changing practice a, la a life changing experience and I felt like I owed it to Nia to give back for everything that it had done for me. And about how often do you practice Nia? Is this something that you do on a daily basis because it is low impact? So when I started out, I was a student seven days a week. I was taking a class every day. Wow. Now I'm teaching four days a week and I at least still take a class one day a week. Are there any people, Teresa, who shouldn't practice Nia, or is this a program really safe for everyone? We talk about being your own conscious personal trainer. We are simply guides, and you and your body tweak the movement the way that you need to to fit you. So yes, Nia is literally open for every body. And in terms of levels uh, for, you know, for more seasoned practitioners like yourself, are there different levels uh, of Nia or is it kind of one class fits all? So the answer to that is yes to both. <laughs> so within each class, we teach personalizing. So you get to change your and choose your range of motions, how, how much energy you want to move through your body at any given time. But then we also have a range of classes. So we, we have a moving to heal class that is a little bit more gentler. And then we all the way up to a move it class, which is more of that high intensity interval. But within any of the classes, you get to choose how you want to move that day. And really quickly, Teresa, before we let you go, where can our viewers go for more information? So the website for Nia is neanow.com. And I also am excited to announce that we have launched a virtual platform that is offering a 14-day free trial at neaondemand.com. Teresa Myers, thank you so much for joining us. And thanks for sharing your story as well. Best of luck to you. Thank you so much, Jen.